subscribe my channel and press the bell icon for more upcoming videos hello guys welcome back to my channel this is mobile tech here today i'm gonna show you how to create the app uh, using macroid fungible and app builder that blocks the vpn user so when you will create the professional app like uh, earning application uh, vpn uh, will block your account so let's get started i have take the three level components and two web get components and json tools and notifier so json tools can be downloaded from the thundkeeperblogspot.com so link will be in description you can download from there and i have used the notifier component also so i will show you the block component a block part so a file will be in description you can download from there when so here you can see when the screen initialized i have called the uh, notifiers using uh, notifier that show progress dialog and i have called the check ip url i have set the check ip url uh, web component to api api dot uh, ip file dot org and i have called the web gate component called check ip so after uh, uh, getting the text or uh, after getting got text check ip got text then i have set, set the one variable i called ip and i have set the response content to the global ip after that so after that i have called the vpn test url i have set the vpn test url to the uh, this one so you can uh, uh, log in and you can get the AP or api from the this site so i uh, go to after logging go to the proxy vpn detection uh, api and go to documentation after going to the documentation you will see the uh, json example requests okay so this first uh, the link copy that link and you can see here paste here that link and hit enter so this will show the your information and you can see that this is my IP. So we will uh, set that IP using that uh, api.api.org which we have called before. So we will set that IP there and we will know the information of VPN and if the user is using Tor or VPN services. So let's uh, see here you can download from, copy from there and I have used the join component and uh, text uh, component after go, uh, that go and paste it and clear all the uh, all the text uh, af before after the IP address so IP address I have uh, uh, cleared that so after that I have set the IP address to global IP you can see that we have called this IP address before using our get component web get component you can see that here we have uh, put the response content to global ip so we have called the global ip then we have you can see their strictness we have copied after the ip address text and after that we have set the ip uh, text to the response content and we have called the vpn test web get component web component after that when VPN test got text, we have call, uh, used the JSON tools that that pairs JSON. So we have called uh, that uh, tool to the response content. So the value will be this. So this will we will get as a JSON file. So we have called this text to the using JSON tools. And we have set the condition also. You can see we have called this all the uh, information. So, okay. After that, we have called the if then block. So, if we have used the and uh, component using uh, uh, from the logic block section. So when uh, VPN will be, you can see their VPN and Tor that uh, that is a string or attribute name. So when the get string attribute name VPN equals to false and uh, 
a get string value attribute name tor equals to false then uh, set vpn text to join we can we have set the vpn condition in the level so we have dismissed the notifier also and we have called the notifier component saying vpn not detected so if it is false then uh, vpn is not connected or detected so okay so uh, and if else if vpn if that any of that uh, value is true then we will show that uh, vpn is connected by tony notifier you can see here when there will be vpn will be true and uh, tor service will be true then we we have called the notifier component saying vpn not connected so let's open the application without vpn you can see vpn not detected vpn tor false so ip is shown so after when i use vpn okay so i will choose global okay sorry cancel just i will tap to connect you can see vpn is connected now after connecting to the vpn let's close the application and so here you can see vpn or tor detected disconnect your vpn or tor notifier will be shown like this so when user will tap on close application will be closed so in this way you can detect the vpn and using api tools so if you like my video subscribe my channel if you like my video like the video and if you want to share then share it to the friends so to be keep connected subscribe my channel